Hi everybody, this is Avalon from Crafts Direct, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can make this welcome fall tin sign. My favorite part of this project is honestly just the colors. These colors, ever since making this project, have now become like my new favorite colors. I hope you like it just as much as I do. The first thing you are going to do is paint the letters F-A-L-L -L, to spell out fall. To start, you are going to paint the letter F in a light brown color. Then you are going to paint the letter A in a orange sort of terracotta color. And then the first letter L is going to be a light blue. And then the second letter L is going to be a mustard color. While you wait for the letters to dry, you will then take your wood word welcome and paint it in that light blue color as well. Don't worry about painting the sides or the edges, just paint the front of the word welcome. Once the wood letters dry, you then can paint the areas that you first held the letter. So paint those areas and then go back and add a second coat of paint as well. Grab your sign and next we are going to lay out our wood pieces. On the left hand side you are going to put the word welcome and you're going to have the word running up and down. And then centered on that you are going to spell out the word fall and you want your letters to be centered on that word welcome. Grab a pencil and place a mark on both sides of the word welcome. We want to know the width of the word. And I first just tried to freehand with paint and I was going for a different look, but then I decided that it's gonna look much better to take some painter's tape and line them up with the marks that you made for the width and then paint over that painter's tape and let it dry completely. Once the paint is dried, you will then slowly peel up the painter's tape. Now you will adhere all of the wood pieces to the sign using glossy accents. Once the glue dries, your sign is now ready to be hung up and displayed. Thank you so much for watching this video. You can shop all the products needed to make this project at craftsdirect.com projects.